What is up, Groveliners? I am finally sitting down to do our 250 subscriber giveaway. Colleen, unfortunately, is not here because she took Melody to the beach this weekend, and we've been trying to get our schedules to work out so that we can sit down together and have the time to do this, but alas, it has not happened, so I'm just doing it to get it done so we can move on because we're already approaching 350 subscribers. We haven't even announced a 250 subscriber giveaway and we have to announce the 500 subscriber giveaway which is what is laid out before me right now. So without further ado, the 250 subscriber giveaway winner is rolling to Orlando. Congratulations, thank you for watching, thank you for subscribing, so I will be reaching out to them, let them know that they are a winner, and that giveaway was all in this bag. It was a smaller giveaway, mostly pins, I will link that video down below of what the details of that giveaway was. There were some lanyards in here, a lot of pins, patches, autograph books, which they are doing now. They are signing autographs at the Disney parks again. So they will come in handy and this 50th anniversary reusable bag. So that is going to rolling to Orlando. All right, let's get ready to do our 500 subscriber giveaway announcement. I have my Wawa peanut butter coffee. If you have not had this, go to Wawa right now. Not right now. Finish watching this first, then subscribe, share the channel, then go get your Wawa peanut butter coffee because it is delicious. The only peanut butter coffee that is better than the Wawa peanut butter coffee is the peanut butter cold brew at Gideon's. There's two locations in Florida. One of them is at Disney Springs where I got this shirt, but they have very good baked goods and they have very good peanut butter cold brew. All right, the 500 subscriber giveaway. Uh, I'm not sure which order we're gonna do this, but there is a lot of stuff, mostly ink and paint. And a few other throw in. So the first item is an ink and paint backpack. And it comes with little markers. I don't know how old this wall is. Like how long it's been sitting around. If the markers work, I have no idea. We did not open any of this stuff or use any of this stuff. I guess you're supposed to color the backpack yourself. I think it's kind of cool just leaving, a, leaving it alone. Having it black and white with just the Mickey color on there. But that is one item number one. I guess I'll just go through the ink and paint stuff first. There is an ink and paint apron. This was cool too. It has so many Disney characters on it and it's black and white at the top and changes to color. If I was an apron wearer I would definitely wear this because it's so cool but I don't wear aprons. I just wear old clothes. <laughs> so someone We'll be getting an ink and paint apron. Ah, these mystery Mickey plushes. Sorcerer Mickey plush. There's five of them, and it's a mystery of which one is in each. We, I don't remember if we opened these or not. We might have opened them, but I don't remember. So they could be all the same color for all we know, but there are three, three of these. We could not find any more ink and paint plushes. All right, this ink and paint plate. Uh, I believe you can put a, you know, it's like have an appetizer serving tray type of thing. It is, you know, real porcelain. So it's not like a toy. It's definitely something you can use at your home if you decorate to the T's in Disney. The next thing is an artist's palette magnetic toothpick holder set. So these Mickey shapes, the back gives you a little better picture. There's all these Mickey head shaped toothpick holders and they fit right in that tray. So if you entertain at your house, you can break this out and display your toothpicks in this nice little set here. Like if you have the cheeses and uh, pickles, all that kind of stuff that needs toothpicks. That is another ink and paint. Now this one, 
this one I was very tempted to not give away. It's really, really nice. Four ceramic plate sets. I should say one plate set, four plates. They are eight inch plates. And on the back you can see what decoration is on the plates. But these would be nice just to display or keep hold on to for keepsake. Maybe they'll be worth some money someday. Who knows? But that's an ink, ink and paint four plate set. Actually, I think that's it for the ink and paint stuff. To keep going with the food theme or the serving theme, I do have a spoon counter saver here. Put your spoon like spaghetti sauce, whatever you're using a spoon for. And this has, it's plaid with a bunch of different Mickeys on it. So that goes with the giveaway. We have burr, 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 Chip and Dale, Rescue Rangers, Salt and Pepper Shakers. I don't know if anybody's seen the Chip and Dale's movie that's on Disney Plus. It's actually pretty good. There's some pretty good humor. There is a ton of guest appearances from Disney characters and not some Disney characters. Chippendale salt, salt and pepper shakers. Some more dishware. Here is a Mickey, a Joe Cool Mickey, or a, I don't know what you call that, Millennial Mickey. Mickey with headphones, drinking his own coffee there. And then on the back it says, Mickey's really swell coffee, Disney Parks. This was another one that I wasn't sure that I would give away, but we have so many mugs. I picked out a couple of these. I gave one to a friend of ours who I know is a Disney fan and a Halloween fan. So this one is a Disney Happy Halloween mug with Mickey and Minnie dressed up for Halloween. I love it, but not enough to keep it. <laughs> and then another coffee mug. I don't know what you call these things. It is, you know, ceramic with one of these ceramic lids. Uh, but it has all of the princess names on it and little icons like, uh, you know, the rose from Beauty and the Beast and the pumpkin cart from Cinderella. So whatever you call this thing. That is also included. Uh, one more dishware. And this was not from the parks, but we thought it was really neat. It's a stitch teardrop glass with like that sunshine design behind it. We thought that was neat. So we got it to give it away. Next thing, this is something we got at the parks. It's a door hanger. I'm looking for my once upon a time or on the other side. It says, I found my happily ever after with the Mickey cut out of the top door hanger. This is a magnetic bottle opener. So you can just stick this on your fridge. We actually have one right now hanging on our fridge. Discover the magic, Walt Disney World. It's your directional logo. I forget what year this was the theme. I think 2018 because I have a sweatshirt when we were down there in 2018 that has the uh, directional, the compass logo on it, on the back. And I believe 2018 was the year for this type of logo. We did have a couple of patches left over, so patched patches. This one is a cocoa patch, and then we have an up patch. So. These are actually included in the 250 subscriber giveaway, but we didn't want to give doubles. We had a couple of doubles, so we're going to add these to this giveaway. Next, another backpack. Yes, you get two. The ink and paint one, and then this one. This one is basically Mickey ear design all over print, and it's pretty big. It has a divider inside so you have the large pocket small pocket plus a zip front pocket plus a water bottle pocket on each side so that is a good 
that's bigger than the ink and paint one. Uh, and then these two, last but not least, we have frames. And again, these, we were kind of torn on giving these away or not, but these Mickey, so they have a little Mickey, hidden Mickeys in the corners. Mickey Mouse frames. These are also from the parks. There's one that is a multi size frame. You can put multiple pictures in it. And then we have a four by six. Very nice. They're kind of matching. So you're going to get some matching frames. But uh, even that old school picture in there of the Disney characters is pretty cool. But uh, we have so many frames. We are not keeping these. They are going away with the winner of the 500 subscriber giveaway. And besides everything that I just showed you for the 500 subscriber giveaway, there are a few bonus items that may or may not be in the frame of this camera right now. So whatever you see inside the frame of this shot, there may be some bonus giveaways in the 500 subscriber giveaway package. So that wraps up our 500 subscriber giveaway. Uh, it's a lot of stuff, more stuff than we ever had. Um, so once we hit 500 subscribers or shortly thereafter, we will be randomly choosing a winner and we will announce it right here. Hopefully the winner has an email address or some way of contacting them so we can let you know instead of trying to reach out through the channel. But congratulations again to Rolling to Orlando for winning the 250 subscriber giveaway. And we will be reaching out to you today to get your address so we can mail you the goodies. And while I'm in the spirit of giving, I am going to give away a Groot right now. The first person who comments on this video, the name of the actor who plays Ego, the father of Star-Lord's character, in Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2, the first person to give me the name of that actor will get a Groot. This is a Walmart exclusive. Came out when the movie came out. I bought several of them. I, of course, have my own on display. But this is the last one. It's yours if you give me the name of that actor. So again, we just want to say thank you to everyone who has watched our channel and subscribes to our channel, who shares our channel. And bonus giveaway coming up. I just came up with this giveaway the other day. So we're going to do it. Uh, this is more for the local people, the people who watch our channel for our Dorney Park videos. We uh, are local to Dorney Park, so we do more Dorney Park videos than anything pretty much. Our first giveaway, a 100 subscriber giveaway, was a Dorney Park specific giveaway. Uh, and we wanted to, again, continue thanking everyone for subscribing. So we do a Facebook channel, which is facebook.com backslash Groveland Vids. As you can see right here, right there. Is that focused? But anyway, I made these really simple cards. So the next giveaway, I am going to be at Dorney Park and I'm going to hide several of these cards to route their gift shops. I don't know how many yet, 10, maybe 20. It's gonna be a limited run because it's gonna be a significant giveaway. So we are going to hide these, number them, and you will have to reach out to us through our Facebook message with a picture of the card so that we know that you found it in the park and you will be entered to win. So we will set a deadline and or when we get photos of all the cards, maybe that'll happen quicker than a deadline. We will then randomly choose one of the people who found these cards to do another Dorney Park giveaway. So there'll be more details of that coming up soon. Uh, but I'm, I believe it will be a live announcement at the park when the day that we do this. So it starts immediately the day that we do the announcement and they're not just sitting out there and people don't know why. So that's another fun giveaway that we're going to be doing. So please subscribe to the channel, share the channel. And if you're local to us and go to Dorney Park, look for the announcement video coming soon. It will, like I said, it will be a live video from Dorney Park. And one more quick announcement for some things coming up on the channel. Uh, in about two weeks, we'll be going to New England. Colleen and I will be going there for about a week. So we do have some things we'll be filming coming out. So subscribe, follow along for more adventures. It's our first time all the way to Maine. So we'll be spending a couple of days in Maine, a couple of days in Salem, 
doing some historical stuff, doing some fun stuff. So if you've ever been to Camden, Maine or Salem, Massachusetts, comment down below and let us know if there's anything cool that you've seen that we should check out while we're there. And then in August, we are going, we already got the tickets to go to the Cirque du Soleil show, the one that's uh, in Washington, DC. So we'll be driving down there on a Saturday, going to the show Saturday night, and then driving back on a Sunday. So we'll have another Cirque du Soleil review coming out. And then shortly after that, we rented an Airbnb in New England again in Massachusetts this time because they have a giant festival called the Big E. If you know what the Big E is, you know what I'm talking about. If you don't know what the Big E is, subscribe below and check it out when we put out those videos because you're going to find out. It's basically a huge festival celebrating all of New England states. Uh, some excellent food, you know, rides, animals, live shows, live music, all kinds of things. So if you've ever been to the Big E in Massachusetts yourself, comment below and let us know what your favorite things to do there are or favorite foods maybe and we'll give them a try. And then after that, Colleen and I already have booked our trip back to Florida. So, uh, and that'll be our anniversary. That's the end of October. So we got a lot going on, a few traveling videos coming up and in between we'll be going to Dorney Park and doing our normal food reviews, things like that. Someday we hope to not be working full time and we can dedicate more time to making fun videos for YouTube. But until then, twice a week is about what we do every Saturday and every Wednesday, sometimes more frequently depending on how much time I have. But again, thank you for everyone who watches and everyone who subscribes. Please share the channel so we can grow. We're approaching 350 subscribers. Obviously the goal is a thousand. Uh, we did already meet our one benchmark to monetize the channel because that is always the goal to be able to make some income so we can improve the channel. A thousand subscribers, here we come. But first, we got to get to 500 so we can do this giveaway. After that will be a big one, a thousand subscribers. Until then, I haven't said this in a while, time is everything, money is a tool, and we can't afford to waste either one. Until next time, last tag.